Hey guys, so really quick, I just want to tell you about a dream I had last night. I actually totally forgot about it until I saw my wall. So let's go check out what's on my wall really quick. So, uh, yeah, we got a, we got a, a spider over here. There's a jumping spider. Oh, look at him go. Jack, watch, let's see if we can see him jump. Let's see, let me zoom out a little bit. Let me zoom out a little bit. Oh, it's like a flower on here. So let's see. Will he jump? Oh, he's not, he's not jumping. He's crawling. I guess he doesn't like to jump on walls. Usually you can see him jump pretty well. Oh, there he goes. There he went. He jumped down there. So anyways, um, oh, let me tell you, let me tell you this uh, really quick story. Oh, let's get in front of the tap hold. So anyways, I had this dream where, of course, I don't remember dreams very well, which is kind of sad. Hopefully you guys will enjoy it nonetheless. It's not really too much about, about the tadpoles, but it does have to deal with the tadpoles. So, uh, in my dream, there was a big spider, like a big spider, it was huge, and it was, I don't remember, it wasn't very like colorful or anything, it was just like a brown spider. And the way I usually think about spiders is, they keep the bad bugs away. They kill all the little other tiny ones that you can't see that you probably don't want to have in your house. So I usually don't mind spiders, especially because they like to stay in little corners and kind of hide away from everybody for the most part, and honestly I'm not that afraid of spiders. So... Um, unless there was a tarantula inside my room or something. Anyways, in my dream, the spider infiltrated my tadpole tank. And I was like, okay, no problem. The spider can, the spider can just chill there. I don't really mind too much, you know. I, okay, fine. He was pretty big, though. Like I said, he was pretty big. In my dream, obviously, you're not very rational. Anyways, I come back, like, a couple hours later, and oh my god, oh my, oh my god. The tadpoles were vicious, like, viciously attacked, they were bleeding, like, their heads, like, their head wasn't chopped off, but, like, like, a, a flap of their skin was, like, chopped off and everything. Oh my god, I got so mad. I've never been mad in a dream before, like, my dreams are always happy and nice and fun. I got so mad at this spider that he did this to my tadpoles, I stabbed him with a fork. Stabbed him. I stabbed him with a fork, and then after I did that, I took the same fork without even, like, doing anything, and I rip, ripped all of his webs all over the place. Now, obviously, this doesn't make too much sense because it's kind of underwater. I figured it was an underwater spider or something. And I ripped all his webs up, and I threw them on the ground. And then I stepped on him. Anyways, that is my dream. And then I was, like, I was so mad at this thing for killing my tadpoles. I go back, and the tadpoles are still swimming around, like, all gimp-like. And I didn't have, I didn't have the heart to, to kill them to like put them out of their misery so I was like I can make them better I can fix them so I was like hoping for the best that the tadpoles were gonna you know get better cause I like I like you know obviously animals I don't I like spiders too but that spider didn't like him very much anyways that's all I'm gonna have you guys today hopefully you enjoyed this random nonsensical dream I just wanted to tell you guys cause I thought it was fairly interesting before I forget about it again so thanks for watching have a super duper delicious day